What's up, YouTube? Back for another one. Hope you enjoyed my last rant I did about Will Smith slapping Chris Rock. But we're not going to get into that. Today is a review. I saw these at Five Below and I had to jump on them. And it's hers ghost paper flavor potato chips gluten free. So on the packaging it says choose your heat and it says hot, but I'll be a judge of that. For those of you who don't personally know me, my tolerance for heat is pretty high. I eat ghost pepper chips and Carolina Reaper chips and hot sauce all the time so this might not be spicy for me it might be spicy for me i don't know because i never have these nutritional facts i know we don't give a damn about that but it says ingredients potatoes vegetable oil contains one or more of the following corn Cotton seed, what the hell is a cotton seed? Sunflower seasoning, maltodextrin, what the hell is maltodextrin? Spice including ghost chili, pepper, the dectrose, sugar, onion powder, garlic powder, yeast extract, torlula, what the fuck is torlula? Yeast. Natural flavors, citric acid, vinegar, and salt. And if you hear a giggling in the background, I got my little cousin right here along with me. I don't know if you saw her head right here, but she's right here with me. That's why she's that's why you hear a little bit giggling. And this particular company is out of uh, I might be butchering this Nottingham, Pennsylvania. So, like I said, I never had these chips, I never heard of them, so I'm looking forward to these. It says on top, satisfaction guarantee, but let's see if I am satisfied. Well, first of all, I am very disappointed. As big as this bag is, that's all I'm getting. As big as this damn bag is, that's all I am getting. Like, damn near 75% of the bag is gone. So, pff, that's disappointing right there. Let's have a smell of them. Well, the smell, it's uh, almost like, if you guys had those chicharrones, hot and spicy, that's what this smells like. That's what it's getting off. Don't really smell spicy at all. It also is giving off a kind of a barbecue type of smell. Let's take a bigger one out because these are like broken up down here. So that's what it looks like. Pretty coated and the stuff. Excuse me. So. Let's see how it tastes. Absolutely amazing flavor. It has a little bit of heat. So I'm surprised. But the heat from these chips are an enjoyable heat. You got to just sit back, chill, and enjoy you. That's how the heat is. The heat, I'm giving out 50 out of 100. Like I said, it's comfortable. It's not too overpowering. It's not like, ooh, it's hot. No. But also it gives you, at the back end of it, the back taste of it, it's also giving you like a sweet barbecue flavor. So, I like it. I actually really like these. I don't know if I had these before. I don't know if I ever reviewed these before. But I like these. 
These are actually pretty damn good. Well, these things are actually pretty damn good, man. I like them. But, the downfall is, damn near less than half the bag is missing. This is the only downfall about this particular brand of chips. Like, half the bag is missing. And I only ate a handful of chips out of this thing. You guys see me. So, that's the only downfall. But on to the rating. Rating for the bag is not all that to jump and scream about. It's it's whatever. Tell you the truth, I'm getting the bag of a 25 out of 100. Only thing that caught my attention is because it says right here, ghost pepper. The only thing that's the only reason why I bought this bag. And the ghost pepper has big print. That's why I caught my attention. And uh, flavor wise, like I said, the flavor is amazing on these. It has that spicy from the ghost pepper, and it has that real sweet flavor from like a barbecue seasoning they use. So, I like it. Now, will I buy these again? Yes, I will. Even though they give you less than half a bag, I'll buy them again. Will I recommend them? Yes, I will highly recommend these chips if you're a spicy freak like me. If you love your food spicy like I do, I'll highly recommend these. Highly recommend them. Flavor-wise on these chips, they're awesome. Like, it's an awesome, awesome flavor. You get the heat from the ghost pepper, and you get that sugary sweetness from, like, a barbecue flavor that, that they're using that they're not mentioning in this. So, I would highly recommend these. Overall rating, I'm giving them 100 out of 100. Like, there's only, I can't really say negative about these, because the only negative about them is, like I said, the packaging. Less than half the bag is gone. I opened it on camera. You guys witnessed it. My cousin right here witnessed it. So this is the only negative downfall about it. I think that the bag was more full. Then I'll be a lot more happy. But these will be gone within the next two days. Sadly. So. Well. That is it for this one. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very, very much for watching. Thank you to all my subscribers. I am up to like 85 subscribers now. So, thank you very, very much to all my subscribers. All 85 of you. To my trolls that talk your mess. Subscribe to my channel. And comment your BS in the bottom. Thank you for that too. Because that just gives me another viewer and another subscriber. So, thank you. My goal... As of right now, we try to get to a thousand subscribers. If I get to a thousand subscribers, I don't know. I'll be extremely happy, but I have to do something outrageous. I might chug a bottle of hot sauce or something. I don't know. But if I get to a thousand, we'll see what happens when we get there, you know. But we'll see what happens. Well, that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next one. But until then... Take care and God bless.